On Thursday, September 1st, the Pitt State football team kicked off their 2011 season on the road against conference opponent Missouri Western. Early in the first quarter, John Brown's going to take back an 84-yard punt return, tying the school record and giving the Gorillas an early lead. Yeah, I already knew I was taking it to the house. I told them before the game started, and my teammates, they set up good blocks, so I ain't do it by myself. They helped me out. Later in the first, Gorillas still up 7-0, and quarterback Zach Dickey shows his speed, getting into the open field and running 44 yards for the touchdown, putting the Gorillas up 14-0. Western's quarterback Travis Partridge trying to extend the play early in the game, but gets met by preseason All-American Nate Dryland. Gorillas would continue to pile it on with a four-yard touchdown run by Solomon Watkins, and then a long pass by Dickey would set up a one-yard touchdown run by Bryston Wilson, giving the Gorillas a 28-0 edge at the half, and there was no looking back from there. Pitt State holds on for the 34-7 victory for their season opener, with senior kicker Chase McCoy tacking on a couple of second-half field goals and Gus Toka leading the way defensively with a team-high two sacks. And after the game, the players and coaches were pleased with their 1-0 start in MIAA play. Well, uh, we were just talking, uh, the coach is telling us that we have a lot of potential in coming out here and actually showing what we can do. It just feels good and, you know, gives us a lot of confidence, which makes us play better. I think, it, well, it's Pitt State, I think we're always going to uh, continue to pride ourselves on our run game. Um, I think we would have liked to throw the ball a little more, but it was kind of a, you know, at times it's just, you know, it's what we wanted to do. I mean, we, we wanted to show, we wanted to show that we uh, can establish the run, and um, this was a great team to establish the run against. Yeah, overall, pretty good job. I mean, there's several things that we need to clean up yet, but uh, very happy with Chase McCoy, made all his extra points and a couple of field goals. Jake hunted well and kicked off well. Of course, John Brown's punt return was phenomenal, and, and uh, he's going to be a pretty scary guy back there, so I wouldn't have to, we don't have to tackle him. The Gorillas will be back at home on Saturday, September 10th to take on the Emporia State Hornets in an MIAA contest, with kickoff being set for 7 p.m.